World War X, I always knew that it was going to be the opening track. Um, you know, the music is written for the lyrics. Now, yes, I'm always writing lyrics, but I don't know what songs they're going to get those lyrics. I'm, I'm generating words, and then when the time comes, they find a song. But with World War X, that one, I was like, this is the opener. It takes us into the album exactly how we need to. And it, it sets you up for the whole theme. It's chaotic. It's relentless. Uh, but then there is this calm before the storm, before the final devastating end. And that song, to me, is basically about the reality of war. You know, the, the last line in that, or the last couple lines in that song is burn the flags and bow to the gun and, and that is the cynical voice that is on the album a lot which is in order to have if you're going to have a path that takes you through having to ask what humanity is and and what life does and doesn't have value I think that cynicism, cynicism to examine that subject is kind of the one of the few ways in so you know, for me, that song was really about acknowledging that if you want to go through this and get to the end, you have to shed your humanity. Uh, so that song is a very cynical, dark song, but it's the setup for what the rest of the record tells us. The World War X music video was, a, again, a very high budget video for us, uh, and we shot out on location at, in the Salton Sea, uh, which is a very difficult location to shoot at. Um, thankfully, I was able to direct the video, and I was on the shoulders of Blake Armstrong, our fantastic DP, and Scott Hansen, uh, one of our producers and uh, the head of the production company. Uh, and what we tried to do with World War X was I wanted to counterbalance the cynicism and the seriousness of the lyrics in the song um, with a video that had a little bit of relief in it. So our video is following a character as he moves through war, a time situation, and he is f facing a lot of the struggles and challenges that are being talked about in the song. Uh, but then at the end, you know, he, he wakes up out of it and, uh, and finds his peace. Uh, so I think for us, it was kind of trying to establish that, yes, we're talking about very serious things and they're very grim subject matter, but at the same time, it's a death metal record. I want people to have fun with it. I want the video to be fun. I want it to be enjoyable and not all doom and gloom. So I thought the video was a great counterbalance to the seriousness of lyrically of the song. Chill!